Let me show you a couple quick ways to make sure that you have weather emergency alerts enabled on your iPhone. The first way that we're going to look at is by enabling alerts inside of settings. To do this, find and open the settings app on your iPhone's home screen. Once you're inside of here, here near the center, choose notifications. Once you're on the notification screen, scroll all the way to the bottom and then down here you'll see alerts. These alerts, typically sent by the government of your country, are not necessarily from an app or from Apple. And the selection down here that you have is actually going to depend on the country that you live in. For me here, I'll tap emergency alerts and then inside of here, just turn on the top two options. By doing this, if there's anything really important that needs to be pushed out, like hurricanes or other natural disasters, then I'll automatically get those government alerts. Next, let's go ahead and make sure that the weather app notifications are set up. These are going to be the notifications that you're probably looking for, like if there's a bad thunderstorm coming up soon or major snowfall. Head back one screen to the main notifications menu and then scroll up a little bit until you see weather here near the center. Choose this and then here at the top, make sure that allow notifications, critical alerts and time sensitive notifications are all turned on. Once you have those enabled, we know that the weather app is going to alert us if there's a notification. And once those are turned on, we can now tell the weather app what to alert us about. You can get to this by scrolling to the bottom here and tapping weather notification settings, but I'll also show you where it's found in the weather app. Close this and then find and open the weather app. Once you're inside of here, down on the bottom right of the screen, tap the list icon. Once you see your list of current and saved locations, Tap the three dot icon on the top right of the screen and then inside of here, choose notifications. Inside of this menu, you can then turn on severe weather and next hour precipitation to get notified about incoming rain. These settings affect your current location by default. You can also enable these alerts for your saved locations by selecting each one of them from the list below and then turning them on individually. I'll go ahead and tap done on the top right and now all of the emergency weather alerts are turned on for my locations. And that's how you enable emergency weather alerts on your iPhone. Thanks for watching.